Yeah, how's everyone doing? Good, I hope. I'm playing Hexen 64 for, for the um, Amway Atari VCS, you know. And I'm, I'm using the Atari VCS controller controller wordlessly, you know. This game's awesome, in my opinion, you know. And uh, uh, the great thing about uh, these new televisions is that they have a, a thing called All Directions Zoom, you know. So you see the way there's this black bar is on the other side of the screen. Just uh, press menu on your controller, on your on your remote, go to um, the aspect ratio and uh, all directions zoom and it, it takes up the whole screen, like, you know. So that's pretty cool, like, you know. And, uh, uh, but, but uh, so pretty cool. Yeah, so this game uh, is pretty cool in my opinion. It's like Doom except uh, it's, 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 you can choose between three characters and it's pretty cool and run, as you can see it runs like butter on the um on the Atari VCS and uh, the, the controller works great with it like you know and uh, it's uh, Hexen is just one of those games you can sit back and enjoy like you know Yeah, the, the Atari VC, the um, Atari VCS is awesome, and uh, pretty cool. And uh, this character here, the mage, um, is the best is the best guy in the game to choose because he's got a, a projectile weapon. A staff, you know, which is pretty cool. Most of the enemies are, are melee uh, enemies, so it's easy to kill them from a distance. But there are some enemies that have four projectiles and they're a bit tougher, like, you know, but pretty cool. There's, uh, so yeah, look at it, it looks great on the Atari VCS. Uh, if you want to play Hexen 64, on your Atari VCS, just go to Chrome on your Atari VCS and type in Hexen 64. And the, the, the setting up the controls is pretty easy enough. Yeah, them flying fellas are a bit dodgy, you know. It's awesome. Now, just the Japanese version of the game, that's what we're seeing. Japanese uh, text and the, the green is blood, like, you know. Just town, town, town on down the violence as much as they can, but still an awesome game. In the European version and the American version of Hexen, the blood is uh, red, you know. Well, those blue voils are healthy, like, you know. And uh, those green yolks are, are like grenades, you know. Sort of like uh, gas grenades. The gas stays there for a while and then the touch it um, gets blown up. And this stuff here charges your 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 other weapons. Like you have these things called frost hands that freezes stuff, you know. And that blue stuff is power for that. Uh, I don't have that the frost hands yet, but we will have them in a minute. And this guy has me cornered, and they're too comfy in this game. They do, you know what I mean? So. Just hold on the forward button and fucking let them have it, you know. So pretty cool. But it, that's what I love about the Atari VCS. You can play uh, games like this and just relax, like, you know. And it looks awesome, the Atari, the Atari VCS, you know. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, so Hexen, it's um, 
it's not broken down into levels like Doom is. You know how in Doom, at the end of each level, there's a switch and then you move on to the next level. Well, uh, Hexen's not like that. Hexen, it's all one big level, like, you know. And the switches that activate stairs and stuff. Like, you see where I'm standing right now? There's a switch later on in the game that turns us into stairs. And behind them golden doors is, like, um, switches and other things that open up the whole level, like, you know. So... It's 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 a lot bigger in scale than Doom is, you know. Uh, but it's, and it's a lot harder in Doom as well, you know. The enemies are, are a lot harder to kill, but it's still an awesome game. And um, if you want a challenge, they play the game. Pretty cool. And it has great it has great graphics for its time and still looks awesome in my opinion, like you know. But Hexen is one of those games that doesn't get enough love, like, you know. Unfortunately, like Doom and Quake get all, get all the attention, you know, but uh, Hexen doesn't, unfortunately. So this is the, the, the Frost Hands, you know, and uh, that blue, that other blue stuff is um, ammo for, for, for your Frost Hands here. You can freeze enemies and stuff. See that idea? So it's, it's hard to strive because I'm, I'm doing this one handedly, you know. See the way my man freezes, yeah. Um, out of ammo. Just shoot them, shoot, shoot them, and they explode pretty kill, you know. Yeah, so way more advanced than Doom is in a lot of ways this is, you know. But I think, I think the reason why Doom is better it has guns, whereas this is like m magic and spells and wands and stuff, but still an awesome game, in my opinion. And it runs great on the entire, on the entire VCS. Yeah, so the, there's a multiple online emulators that play this game. Uh, when, when, when you choose uh, Hexen, when you type in N64 Hexen on Chrome on the Atari VCS, the first suite emulator games online is the suite to use. Uh, the Japanese version seem, seems to work great, you know. Uh, for some reason, the American and the European version works sometimes, but not all the time. Uh, now, If you want to play the PS1 version of, the, of um, Hexen, just type in PS1 fun. Now the PlayStation version has, has the blue, that has the English uh, text, but the, the frame rate isn't as good as this. And the enemies are, are always facing towards it in the PS1 version. Whereas in this the N64 version, you can see the enemies are, you can see them from the side, from behind and stuff. And the frame, so like the N64 version is just, just a better version of the game, you know. Yeah, but if you want to play the PS1 version, just type in PS1 fun, then it'll be under H for hexing, you know, so pretty cool. Yeah, but I'm using the uh, VCS controller wordlessly and it works great, like, you know. And um, set, setting up the controls is pretty easy, up for up, down for down and stuff. Now, because the N64 controller has more buttons and it's laid out differently, it takes a bit longer to figure out what button does what, you know what I mean? Because it's with, with the N64 controller, the Z button, which is underneath the controller, is the 4 button. So that's the main button to figure out what, what to select, if you know what I mean. You know? But it doesn't, doesn't take long to figure out and, and, and to, to configure the controls for the Atari VCS uh, controller. And it, it works just fine. I'm doing all this one handed, like, you know. Like, like strafing is a bit awkward, like, you know. So pretty cool, like, you know. Yeah, so Hexen for the N for the N sixty four brilliantly can we we've, we've never finished this game. It's, just, it's so massive this game. Uh, we just I haven't had the time to finish it. Uh, but um, yeah, we've, we've we've played the PlayStation version. We've played the Sega Saturn version. We've played the N sixty four version, and um, the N sixty four version is the best in my opinion. Uh, uh, it runs the best. It looks the best. You know. 
uh, but because Hexen 64 is on a cartridge, uh, I don't know if all the levels are there. That, that, like, that's one of the restrictions the N64 had. The games were on cartridges. Because of that, the games weren't as big or, or cut back in size because the, the N64 cartridges didn't have the storage capacity. So I don't know if this has all the levels of, of Hexen. I don't know, but all, all, I, can, all I can tell it is fun. It looks awesome. And it plays great, and that's all that matters to me. Uh, you know, the Sega Saturn version is really pixelated. The frame rate isn't as high as this, and the enemies are all facing towards it. Um, but it's more accurate to the PC version. Um, and the, the PS1 version is based off the Sega Saturn version. They're all... Hexen Force came out on the PC, so they're all uh, parts of that, you know. But, uh, you know, uh, the N64 version is better than all of them put together, in my opinion. You know, looks the better, runs the best. It might not have, it might not have all the content that the other ones do, I don't know, because, like I said, I, have, I haven't finished the N64 version of the game. But because it's on a cartridge, I don't think it is, because it just, it just doesn't have the storage capacity. But it might have, I don't know, you know what I mean? But uh, pretty awesome. So, yeah, that's excellent for the... Um, N64, N64 running on the Atari VCS full screen. And like I said, um, just go to all direction zoom on your television. I tell you, all modern televisions have them in now, like, you know. Um, just enjoy the game, you know. So I hope everyone has a good day. Take care and bye-bye.